hello and welcome back to my channel for today's video i'm going to take you guys along for my sunday reset um now mind you i normally start this right in the morning and it's already almost 3 30 but we had guests over this morning and this afternoon so kind of threw back my sunday plans that's okay we're gonna see how much i can actually get done um but yeah i just thought i'd take you guys along with me we're also gonna do jersey's valentine's day craft i'm gonna film that because i think it's gonna be super super cute fingers crossed that she cooperates because i don't know how this is gonna go we're painting her foot <laughs> i don't know how this is gonna go because she's kind of a spastic baby whenever you touch her she kind of like jolts so we're gonna see so i made a list of stuff that i normally get done on sundays Mind you, two of these things are definitely not getting done today because it's groceries and meal prep. And I'm not going to the grocery store at 3.30 on a Sunday. I'll go tomorrow morning. So, yeah, we're going to take you guys along with us. going to start by cleaning the house because after a long week, the house <laughs> normally takes a hit. So we're going to start with cleaning the house and go from there. Yeah, our Canadian Super Bowl Sunday here. Not watching the Super Bowl at all. we got hockey on the TV. We do have snacks, though. Snacks for sure. There's dad on the couch couple over there. Quiches. Couple quiches, yeah. Jersey's over here reading her, or <laughs> staring. Looks like she's reading it, but it's just her black and white photo. Black she pictures. is very interested in it. Yeah. She's smiling underneath of there. I love their pictures. You having a smile? Honestly, any parents watching the Love Every um, Toy subscriptions, best thing I ever did. She loves. Oh. <laughs> She loves all of them so much. What do you think? Should mommy go clean the house now? Yeah, because you're a messy girl. <laughs> stove top there there's those are our snacks that we were having there on the coffee table over there but cleaning that area next I just moved them over here obviously still little bits and pieces that's stuff for Jersey's craft 
and still needs to do all the bottle dishes. Moms that are pumping and bottle feeding, like I am, you'll know how annoying it is. There's always pump, there's the pump parts to wash, there's the bottle parts to wash, and their lives. It's a never ending cycle, so. Although I hate dishes sitting in the sink, those are some dishes that just have to sit there because it's better doing them all at once than in little stages. So we're gonna move on to the living room next. It's not that bad in here. Tracy's down for a nap, finally. She's been a little bit on the fussier side today. I know it sounds crazy, she's only two months old, but I'm pretty sure she's teething. Like she has really rosy cheeks, she's drooling like crazy. She's like uncomfortable. So, pretty sure she's teething. But yeah, so I'm gonna do the living room and the dining room. And then I'm gonna clean the bathroom as well. Our bedrooms were like just cleaned. I'm pretty sure I did them on Friday, so they're pretty good. I'll just tidy up whatever needs to be tidied up. And then wash the floors, so get back to cleaning.
our dinner plan done as well as I wrote our grocery list so that when I go to the grocery store tomorrow it's just easy I know what I'm getting I'm not wasting money I'm not wasting food I'm just gonna switch the laundry over I always start alone in the morning so that by like midday it's done and I can switch it over just it works for me but obviously I forgot about it today so Next thing on my list is I just have to finish um, updating my planner, update the calendar if there's anything else I need to add to it, and then wash the floors. Now Jersey is still sleeping. <laughs> she's been asleep for almost two hours and she's still just like out cold there. She's smiling so she's obviously dreaming in her sleep right now. So um, I guess I could have vacuumed and mopped earlier but did not so it is what it is. I'm actually going to take a second while she's still sleeping and prep the Valentine's Day craft we're gonna do with her. So this is the craft. Little, we're gonna use her feet and make, I don't know if it's gonna focus, little love bugs. So I have two canvases here for the grandparents and then cardstock um, for ours to keep in her memory box and then for a couple of our friends, we're gonna send them Valentine's. So it's just, I'm just gonna write on them to prep them um, so for Carson's parents, uh, Glammy and Grandpa's love bug, then for my parents, No No and Nona's love bug, and then I'll put like Mom and Dad's love bug, whatever, right? And then I'll just write Jersey 2022 on it. So I'm gonna prep that so that at least when she's up and happy, we can get her footprint on all of it. We can just put it in a row and go bam, 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 bam with her foot. So yeah, I'm gonna get that ready. that already I'm gonna see if I can find red construction paper to use for these two I don't think we have construction paper in the house but you never know I do work in a school when I'm not on that leave so now that the craft is prepped for when she wakes up she's still sleeping if she's still asleep after I update my planner I think I may just vacuum the mop and hope the best but I'm just gonna sit down and obviously I have to make my planner now. Like I said, this is the planner I use. It is a hefty, hefty boy, but I love it. It's a Rise Up planner. So, so you fill out, this is last week's, so you fill out the week, some goals here, win the week. And then the weeks, it is broken up into the hours. I love time blocking. It's a marketing plan, all that. So I'm actually just gonna sit and do this right now and then see you guys later. Mm -hmm. 
Updated my planner, updated the wall calendar with anything that I had to add to it. Jersey is still sleeping, so I'm just gonna vacuum and hopefully I can mop the floors. And we're just gonna hope for the best. Hopefully she doesn't wake up cranky. She normally doesn't wake up to the vacuum, like I said, but watch this time. She actually does. That would be just my luck. <laughs> to vacuum completely before she woke up and then she woke up when I was about to start to mop so curse better burped her now they're just kind of hanging out over there she's smiling look having smiles <laughs> do a smile do a smile oh no maybe not boop, boop, boop. <laughs> so cute but finished mopping oh, the floors <laughs> of course she smiles when I'm not filming mm -hmm. but um, I'm telling you, everyone needs to go buy one of these Bissell Spinways. It makes mopping so easy and it goes in like a kind of like a buffer style. I feel like it leaves the floors so much cleaner and shinier. It smells so good. Everyone needs to get one of those, invest in one of those. They are so amazing. It honestly makes it so easy to mop because you plug it in and it's motorized. So it kind of does the job for you. You just have to guide it along. So. Highly recommend that. But that is it pretty much for the Sunday reset. Normally I would do groceries and meal prep, but like I said, I did start later today. So it is seven o'clock now. Jersey's up, she's fed. So we're probably gonna do her craft. I will film that and show you guys the outcome. I'm really excited. So this is the finished product. We had to redo the one for us, the one for our friends, just because it was a little bit of catastrophe. Painting a two month old foot. Harder than I thought it would be. Actually, no, I figured it would be hard, but. Turned out to be pretty hard. But anyways, thank you guys for joining me for my Sunday reset. I hope this inspired you to do your own Sunday reset because I'm telling you, when you wake up on Monday morning and the house is just completely clean and everything feels nice and organized, you'll feel so much better and ready to start the week. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe, and we'll see you next week. Bye. Mm -hmm.